Hello, good day, Mr. Jackman. G'day, mates. Oh, how's it going? <laughs> Don't worry about the accent, though, because uh, my name is Bogart the Explorer. I'm from uh, a land down under the Philippines. Double <laughs> city. You could have played. You you could have played my character, mate, Bogart. Hi. Right. If I was a quarter as handsome, probably. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just I'm just like one sixteenth at this moment. <laughs> all you needed, all you need, Bogart, is a mullet, and you're there. Hey. Quick question though, was the mullet absolutely necessary to, for you to play the character? Was that a Blomkamp decision or yours? That was a Blomkamp decision. It was not necessary, but I loved it. <laughs> so you played a character closer to home on this one. Being yeah. like a, yeah. an Australian. Did, did you go full Aussie or do you never go full Aussie? Mate, this is as full Aussie as I can do. <laughs> this character, Vincent. It, 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 my actual Aussie for other people like my accent is probably a four or five out of ten. This was a twelve out of ten, mate. Only, wow. only a full bore, full on Aussie would say I'm mad as a frog in a sock. <laughs> I might be a few sandwiches short of the picnic there, mate. But I'll tell you, fifty k sale the whoop whoop, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Mate, you got it. So um, here you uh, you can sing, you can dance, you can act. Is there anything that you can't do? Uh, yeah, I'm the world's worst handyman. That's for one. That's for starters. <laughs> don't get me to try and fix your computer, because I don't. I probably. Would, I, don't, I actually worked in a gas station, in a petrol station, for right. four years, and I still don't really know even where the oil dipstick is. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, you're lucky because in the Philippines we got people here to do that for us. You Trust know, you me. Don't, you yeah. Don't have to Trust pay them. Oh, really? You yeah. don't? No self-serve no. in the Philippines? Yeah, no, it's not self-serve. I mean, we don't. We have people do, um, put the petrol on the tanks, and they even wipe our windshields clear, and we just give give them like one cent, you know, <laughs> for, as a tip. Now, go, <laughs> now here going back to the movie though. You've been playing a lot of villains lately. I mean, uh, you know, from from uh, Peter Pan and such. But what makes Vincent Moore a lot different? And what do you think makes a good villain? Uh, great question. What makes Vincent a little bit different, I suppose, is the bad guy. In fact, by the way, this whole film, the character you love the most is the robot. Almost all of the humans in it, to differing degrees, are kind of very self-centered. So, uh, and it's one of the things I think he was exploring in the movie, but Vincent really hates artificial intelligence. He believes oh it's evil. He thinks this is the beginning of the end. Only God should be creating artificial intelligence. And oh. he's not alone. I mean, I haven't heard, I don't know if they, they believe as strongly as Vincent, but Bill Gates and um, Stephen Hawking both recently have come out against artificial intelligence. So Neil is not afraid to let the antagonist have a very valid argument. But what makes a good villain? I mean, if I think back, some of the greatest villains, I think, you know, uh, Alan Rickman in Die Hard, Javier Bardem in The Latest Bond, or in No Country for Old Men, Christoph right. Waltz in uh, Inglourious Passes. I mean, I think there has to be a little bit of humor. You have right. to feel like the actor's having a good time. I just worried in this one, I was having too much of a good time. <laughs> yeah, not as that. I mean, how was it like working with uh, with Neil Blomkamp? I mean, was it a lot easier or harder? Because you didn't do a lot yeah. of sci-fi films. It's easy, it's much easier. I've done a lot of sci-fi, but Neil knows exactly how to do all the action and all the visual effects. There are 400 visual effects shots in this movie, and yet a lot of people will not even think it's visual effects because it's so, realistic what he does he just knows how to do it and it was very simple there was no green screen nothing like that on set it was just it was easy wow awesome hey though i'm a big fan wolverine i'm just saying because in the philippines we're big wolverine people oh. we got a uh, merchant oh. x-men in look at your face it's very accurate <laughs> see see how the eyes are so expressive they're so expressive, they're on your nose. <laughs> but I know which of those three you're going to be playing with, Bogart. This one. <laughs> it's, it's a girl with the chicken pox, actually. <laughs> Quick favour though, can I take a chaffy with you? You know what a chaffy is? No. A chaffy is a selfie with chappy star. <laughs> hey, come in, mate. Let's take a chaffy. Come on, come on, real quick, real quick. Let's okay. Do it. Everybody say chappy. 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 Hey, thank you. <laughs> you, you are the man. Thank Good you. on you, Bogart. Take care, buddy. Good on you, man. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Your Jackman will be ready.
in. Cheer up, Bogart, will you? <laughs> <laughs>